People have always told me how to do things. People always told me I do things wrong. What they don't realize, I really don't care. I do things the way I want. I do things my way. Hi, FBB Pro Johnny Jackson. I'm up here today trading with my client TJ Clark, who's getting ready for 2014 USA. As you can see, starting out the workout, we start with incline. TJ Clark here. We're about six and a half weeks out right now. I've been prepping with Johnny Jackson since 20 weeks out. Come on, baby. Some motherfucking pressure on me. He got me rolling on a little bit of off season and then uh, switched me over to contest prep mode. He's been dialing me in ever since. His uh, weak body parts are, and I say weak, they're not really weak, but compared to everything else, he can bring them up his chest and back. There we go. So I come out uh, on uh, two days a week here at Destination to train with him, just to give him that extra push and that extra umph he needs, you know, to bring up the body parts uh, for the USA. Because you're only as strong as your weakest body part or your weakest link. Yeah. I like to view myself at more as a coach than actually a trainer or a nutritionist. I don't have a degree in nutrition, so I hate to say I'm somebody's nutritionist. Um, I've just been in the business for uh, over 20 years or so, and uh, you know what I mean? Just through uh, life experiences, I'm able to help someone reach this goal and uh, trying to uh, turn pro. It already hurt. <coughs> Bring the pain, baby. Bring the pain. Boom, baby, just about six weeks. He's been a great coach. He, uh, he takes things serious. He takes it personal. Come on, TJ. Slight. You got damn right. Come on. All of us white weight, baby. He's been there for me, very receptive. Uh, anytime I have questions, he's, he's been real responsive. Uh, sorry about that. Come on, come on. Uh, uh, okay. Talking about forces and He's been really good on pushing me to that next level, pushing me past the point of what I can do on my own. Come on. I'm talking about nothing left. But there's gotta be. Yep. Got it, got it. Ah. So it's a funny story, I've been doing this ever since I was in high school, uh, my freshman year, and that was a long time ago. Uh, <laughs> um, I remember a friend of mine, uh, he was a little bit overweight. Uh, so over the summer, all the stuff my brother had taught me, I got him in the gym with me and we trained, trained up and got ready for football. And uh, he never had started. And in the beginning of that year in football, he actually started and everybody noticed his uh, weight drop and his strength increase. Then they started a little thing saying uh, he was on the Johnny Jackson program all summer. And uh, that's why I was able to start uh, on the defensive line and uh, stuff like this. So it started way back when I was 16, around 16 years old, uh, when I was young, enjoying help, helping people out. <sighs> Cable, super set with push-ups. Another fly for that or another press? Either we do dumbbell, light dumbbell presses, and then flies. Let's do that. Yeah. Uh, 
I've really enjoyed his training methods. Um, he busts his ass in the gym. Uh, it's very motivating when I'm here, of course, training with Johnny Jackson. You're gonna push yourself a little harder. Um, someone, you know, he's gonna be strong. He's not somebody I'm gonna outlift. So it's nice to have that push. Um, his diet's been really good. It's you know, starting to be a struggle, just like any prep is. But um, it's, it's going really well. Yeah, come on. Get it. Get it. Come on. Ah, come on. Ah, ah. Get it. Oh. Ah. Uh, I believe in, you know, actually getting, like I said, down in the trenches and uh, I don't like putting somebody through something I wouldn't go through myself. Felt good till about a week ago. That's kicking my ass. It's good. I know. Doesn't know what that means. Yep. Like I said, uh, coming up, I was privileged to have coaches that actually got dirty. And so that's my belief is that if I can't do it, why should I try to make someone else or try to coach someone else into doing it if I'm not willing to do it myself? He's not just going to tell me what to do. I know he practices what he preaches. I know he's putting himself through the same misery he's putting me through. I know uh, he's doing every, at least every rep that I'm doing, and that's that's motivating. That keeps me going. It's good. Yeah, man. Good work. Take a look at him. Pull the turn right. Nice. And knees. Front double bicep. I feel like I'm doing this for myself, but now I have another accountability you know, towards him. You got judges over here and judges over here. Show little by little. Slow turns. Of course, I'm going to do this and bust my ass regardless, but. Front lat spread. Now that's just another person I don't want to disappoint. Man, I'll tell you that the best case scenario is uh, seeing him standing on stage and getting his hands raised. And back to the bicep. You know, as a 2014 USA, Mr. USA champion, my God, I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it. Elbows forward. That feeling of uh, excitement, uh, accomplishment, and uh, everything you worked hard for, there is laid out right there. And uh, you're getting the main reward for it. So uh, I'm definitely looking forward to that day. Excellent. Good job, TJ. That's what I needed to see. Definitely, man. Good job.